okay so a very good question was asked on the channel that when the patient lands in septic shock when the vasopressor dose is increasing we all add steroids which is recommended in the form of hydrocortisone to the patient so whether we should give hydrocortisone as bolus like 6 hourly or we should give as infusion as a continuous infusion uh, which is better so basically the idea of giving hydrocortisone as infusion emerged that giving boluses dose of hydrocortisone or steroids can cause hyperglycemia which has a detrimental effect in septic shock. So they tried with continuous infusion. But whatever the studies, whatever the literature, whatever the meta analysis ha have been done, they showed that there is no mortality benefit or no change in the hyperglycemia whether given as bolus or uh, as an infusion. In fact, there is no change in hypernatremia, ISO associated weakness, vasopressor free days, ICU length of stay. So it's up to you whether you need, need to give bolus or infusion, bolus is recommended. Do read more about it.